Hi, welcome to All About WordPress. Today we will be learning how to integrate flexible checkout for WooCommerce plugin. Before we start, this video is sponsored by AppMaker.xyz. AppMaker is an app building platform which enables you to convert your WooCommerce store into beautiful native Android and iOS apps. Do check it out. Flexible checkout fields helps you to customize WooCommerce checkout fields. So with this help of this plugin, you can edit the default fields like you can change the levels, you can delete any field and also you can add your own fields. You can see the WordPress plugin page of Flexible Checkout Fields plugin. You can either download it from here and upload it to the WordPress dashboard by going to Plugins, Add New and Upload Zip by clicking on the Upload plugin. Choose file. Otherwise, you can just search for the plugin over here. And install. And then activate it. See the plugin is activated. You can either go to the plugin settings by clicking on the settings button, or as you can see it under WooCommerce checkout fields. So these are your WooCommerce default fields. So you can also rearrange the fields, like you can see it over here. I'm gonna change the country or region to be under the postcode. So I'm going to change the country or region below the postcode and I'm going to save it. Just drag and drop to change the order. I'm going to reload the site. You can see the country or region has changed. It's now it's under postcode. So you can easily change the order of the fields. So if you want to add a new field, you can just go to the add new field section. Click on the field type. There are different fields type available, but all these fields are not available in the live version. So you have to upgrade to Pro if you want checkbox, radio button, etc. So I'm just going to use single line text. And I'm going to name it as test. You can see its name of the field to be building on this product. So it's the ID of the field. So I'm just naming it as test and I'm going to add field by clicking on the add field button. And now I'm going to place the test just below the last name field. Save the changes. Now reload your site. You can see the new field test is just below the last name. So you can add the field as well as you can change the order. You can place wherever you want. And this is just the building fields, the same way you can do with shipping field by going under the shipping tab. And if you want to add or change any order fields, you can go to the order section. And if there is any visual glitches of your UI problems, you can just disable this CSS jQuery UI because this plugin is adding a default CSS that might sometimes for some sites, it may cause some UI issues. If it's there, you can just disable it and that will be solved and save the changes. So this is how you can easily customize the WooCommerce checkout fields using flexible checkout fields for WooCommerce. Thank you.